MSI RX 580 before mod the BIOS so this is the stock BIOS running 24.949 it's not done for the tuning yet it's still auto tuning with uh, what that the RX Boost 19 so so far is 25.789 megahertz rest per second is keep still keep going up okay looks like the maximum is 25 to 26 megahertz per second okay let's see we mod the bios right now just like usual we're gonna save the stock bios using the tech power up gpu z okay this is the stock bios here Okay, we're gonna save it I already create the folder and I name it MSI RX 580 gaming X in the BIOS okay here you, you go MSI RX 580 gaming X so I'm gonna name it this one as stock BIOS here we go stock BIOS and then we save it okay and then now we close and then close again the folder we can close everything for now and then we are gonna use the mining BIOS mode Polaris BIOS editor okay we click double click and then you can click yes open the BIOS and then open the stock BIOS here the folder this is the stock bias we just saved okay and then thereafter you just one click timing and then yes Samsung memory Uber mix and then do you want universal Hynix timing yes and then click OK and then do you want to buy the pro version just click no and then you can save the BIOS now. Just click save S and then you can click this and then name it modded BIOS. So we change. Just like that, modded BIOS and then you save it. And then close this program. And then we're gonna open another software AMD VB Flash. Here we go. And then we're gonna click driver install first. Yes. And then type I. And it will be install the driver for the AMD VB Flash driver. So make sure after you're done, you have to uninstall again back to the same program and then click uh, uh, click you to uninstall okay now we can open the amd pb plus double click and then yes and then you just load the image and then go to the bios mode that you save it before here double click and then click program That will be take about like couple second only. It says it's a minute, but couple second will be done. Okay, the program is successfully. And then click OK, and then just restart the computer. Okay, now we just wait until the AMD software uh, pop up or load. Right now, it's about like uh, three, four, ten seconds. Just wait for a while. 
after you see the icon uh, the AMD software pop up and then you can run you see that and then pop up now and still loading a little bit okay now right click open AMD software okay everything is still the same the GPU core clock is 1150 and then the memory VRAM is one, uh, 2150 still the same we close this and then we run again the miner and check how many hash rate we got after modded the BIOS here we go the flag 4 I'm using before is 25 to 26 megahertz per second and then let's see now let's wait for a while until it's loaded everything and then tuning the hash rate to the maximum hash rate okay as you see here already sub from 23.749 and then 26.971 is not even tuned uh, properly yet so wait for a while as you see here 27 28.74 megahertz per second 29 30 megahertz per second now as you see 31.237 31 uh, actually for the RX uh, 580 590 uh, the best hash rate is maximum up to 32 uh, megahertz per second but it's better you running at 31 or 30.500 uh, 30 because if too high that will be crash or freezing so you can add more for this but for me that's already very good enough so right now I'm gonna load all my GPU back to the uh, rack so we're gonna run uh, all G four GPU for mining the Ethereum for this one okay all four GPU already connected okay and also I'm trying one 750 watt uh, power supply from HP and then loading to four GPU, I would like to know is it can handle or not. So let's try, and we're gonna see the device manager. Make sure everything, all the GPU is running. As you see here, one, two, three, four. I have one 590. That is the XFS. Okay, and then we close. And then I'm gonna do a little bit tweak on all GPU to make sure everything is running. Okay. Oh, sorry, I have to run as administrator. Yes, okay, so I'm gonna tweak the all the GPU uh, ready for mining. Okay, okay, all the GPU is set for mining, and then I'm gonna close and then make sure all the GPU is in compute mode. As you see here, all the GPU is in compute mode and then we can start the AMD software and normally everything is already loot with uh, the manual loot that uh, the previews you already set up okay GPU 2 is for the the new one the MSI is still 150 150 okay 1150 2150 that is enough for me because uh, as we test before 31.300 megahertz per second that's very good number so this one 590 okay okay this is the GPU 4 everything is good 
and then we close this and then we run the mining software okay I'm using the Pinic Miner so I'm using the Flexpo uh, where is it here you go Flexpo double click it okay and then let's see all the GPU is already running here GPU 1 2 3 and 4 okay I have another mining rig over there too this is total 12 GPU here okay okay let's back here because this is total for GPU that will be take for a while for tuning up the hard rate probably for the complete tuning about like 3 minutes I will get back after the maximum hard rate okay we back here we already get some share here found for GPU 3 GPU 4 GPU 3 okay uh, the GPU 1 hard rate is 31 point five hundred and then GPU 2 31.200 GPU 3 is 31.500 and then GPU 4 31.100 so this is not complete yet as you see there the yellow uh, message are auto tuning heart rate may be low until they are ready right now it's not ready yet so 31 mega heart rate per GPU that is very good number uh, you don't have to tune up above uh, 32 like that because we'll be crush uh, the GPU so better say it's better say uh, 31 or under all right folks uh, thank you for watching you have a good day bye